Good evening. In the last few hours, the Iranian regime has launched over 200 ballistic missiles at civilian targets in Israel. It's too soon to assess the impact fully, but I utterly condemn this attempt by the Iranian regime to harm innocent Israelis, to escalate this incredibly dangerous situation and push the region ever closer to the brink. It cannot be tolerated. We stand with Israel and we recognize her right to self-defense in the face of this aggression. Iran must stop these attacks together with its proxies like Hezbollah. Iran has menaced the Middle East for far too long. Chaos and destruction brought not just to Israel, but to the people they live amongst in Lebanon and beyond. Make no mistake, Britain stands full square against such violence. We support Israel's reasonable demand for the security of its people. I've spoken today to Prime Minister Netanyahu, the King of Jordan, President Macron, and Chancellor Schultz. In the last week, I've also spoken to other leaders, including Prime Minister McCarthy of Lebanon, President Abbas, the leader of the Palestinian Authority, to try to find the space for a political solution to the conflicts in Lebanon and Gaza. Because I am deeply concerned that the region is on the brink, and I'm deeply concerned about the risk of miscalculation. The situation in Lebanon is increasingly grave. I want to repeat my advice to British nationals who are still in Lebanon. You must leave now. You should register your presence with government officials on our website. We have a chartered flight and we're doing everything we can to get people out. But the situation is extremely volatile. So if you have the means to leave, the time is now. Do not wait.